I hope you're ready for this. Oh God, oh God. Hey, oh, the body is loose. Hello everybody, Grace Who Believes, and we're back with more My Summer Carnival. So what do you guys said to uh, piss in the sink? So there you go. Don't say I never did anything for you. Also, I noticed that there was a bunch of like graphic settings that I didn't have on. So I don't know if anyone will notice. I put on like, I think I'm still like piss. Oh God, the flies are already around. I think I was just pissing all over my rug. I put on like sun shafts, the shafts and detailed water and shadows or something or other house shadows or whatnot. So things should look a little bit better now. But you guys think as I do, you were saying, hey, Gray, why don't you attach the car to the tanker, put the tanker on the train track, sit in the car and see what happens as you get launched into the air. Damn it. That sounded like a damn fine job. And it's something I wanted to do as well to the crap. Where did I leave the tanker at? It's around here somewhere. I I'm pretty sure it's, um, where did we leave it? Oh yeah. It's back over at the, the, uh, airport. Someone was saying too, that there's a new inspection place or there's a new place behind the inspection place. So I think we'll go check that out. Plus I need to save so that I, I can stop freaking having to drive a million miles in order to get to the tanker. I have to do this every time we reset the game. And quite frankly, it's a giant pain in the testicular region and I don't have time for it. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pick up the tanker, drive over to the store, which is where the inspection place is, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's over by the, it's over by the store. And we're gonna check that out real fast. Then we're gonna save. Then I'm gonna sleep in the back of the freaking, uh, the freaking thing over there. You guys were saying to try and get the, the bus onto the train tracks, mother of God. I don't know how I would do that. <laughs> that sounds epically hard. Um, I mean, I, I guess I could like shove it along with the tanker because I think the tanker can move it, but man, what a pain in the nuts that would be. Uh, well, that didn't really look both ways, but whatever, I'm sure we'll be fine. You guys were saying too, put like a ton of groceries in the vehicle and let it get hit by the train. Oh, mother of God. The insanity, Jesus H. The insanity that happens when we hit the train already, the game goes absolutely freaking berserk. It has just a spastic outrage whenever we have those crashes. I can't imagine what would happen if we put a bunch of freaking groceries inside. I know some people were saying in the comment section, like when they go and do crashing and stuff like that, it locks up their computer and it's freaking horrible. I've got my seatbelt on too, just in case that sorry ball bag comes pulling around one of these corners. If you remember, we killed him last time. Tell you boys what, flying down the back road like a pro, like a freaking guy that always runs into this tree over here. I will tell you, is that? I just lost my freaking muffler again. Every damn time. I might as well just keep the freaking thing off of this vehicle. I'm so tired of having this muffler go go just rocketing off the back. I, I Well, I guess if I didn't want it to go rocketing off the back, I could go ahead and not crash. But that's not going to happen. It's always that turn there, too. It's like, I know it's coming up. I go to hit the, uh, I go to hit the brakes and it's just never good enough. Although to be fair, it's not really like it matters because in a little bit here, this thing is gonna be nothing more than a twisted wreckage, a, a sorry husk of metal and death. So I guess the muffler here or there isn't really worth too much in the end. Did we leave the tanker back at the, back at the store at some point? I almost feel, okay, good, no, there it is. I can see it very clearly in the distance. Hold on here, we're coming right up on it. But luckily we have some fantastic brakes. There we go. Pull it right to about here should be good. Turn this thing off. Let's go ahead and hook her on up. Don't worry, I'm grabbing a beer as well. I know you guys are waiting for it. Can't go too long now. Can't go too long without my life's blood. <laughs> Gotta make sure to throw some in there at some point. Let's see, where in the living hell is... Oh, I'm starting to wobble a little bit. After only one beer, man? Come on now. There we go. All right, now that we're all hooked up, let's fire up the old glow pl plugs and get us out of here. Oh, you know what? 
since everything is going to go flying out of this vehicle, because it always does, if there is some food back here, I think I would love to eat it right now. Maybe a piece of sausage. There's a lot of beer back here. Oh, oh, it's empty plastic. I was hoping maybe it was a little bit of juice hanging around, but I guess not. Nope, doesn't look like there's any food at all. If I remember correctly, there may be a sausage. A, a special surprise sausage inside of the tanker here. There often is. I like to leave sausage everywhere, and you should as well. Let's go ahead and turn this on so that could get going. Oh, oh, do you see it? Do you see it? Surprise sausage! Right there! Exactly what I wanted. I'm gonna grab another beer too, because we might as well. Oh, I just thought about something, boys. Since we're going over by the store, you know what else we can do? I don't know. I don't know if we'll be able to tow it all. Oh god, going off-road a little bit here. But the other thing that we could do is we could grab the van. We could hook the van behind the tanker and then the car behind the van. And we could put it all on the train tracks and blow everything up in one shot. All right. Coming up on Periarvi over here. There it is. There's the uh there's our uh our our van. We can use that for sure. Now I don't know if there's train tracks close to this area. I'm gonna have to wander around and look a bit here. First things first, though. Let's go ahead. Oh, our tractor's over here, too. Ah, crap! Drive it right to the tractor. Well, this is, uh, this is kind of precarious. I didn't really mean to do this, but, uh, I think everything turned out for the better. Go ahead and pull back a little bit here. There we go. Now things are looking much, much better. All right, throw that on, turn this off, open this up. While we're at it, we could also gas everything up. Well, this is what I was talking about. I told you it was only, oh, there's a fender inside. That's cute. I told you it was inevitable that this entire vehicle just fall to absolute pieces while it's on the back over here. At least the doors are still on. I do appreciate that. Over here, this jerk ass is probably going to yell at us now and again. Is this place even open? Oh, it is. Good. Good. Yes. Hello there, sir. While I'm here with you, I think I'll go ahead and buy everything so we can throw it and put it inside of the car. All of your sausages, please. Actually, all of everything. Oh, don't you worry. I'm going to... You keep that store open because I'm going to make it worth your while, buddy. I am going to make it worth your freaking while. Yes. Yes. Give me all of this crap. All of the yeast as well. Now, I think that all this stuff fits inside of one bag. All the milk... And I think that you guys said that that was sour milk or something down there. I can't grab that at the moment. All the sugars. And that should be it. I think that that's everything that you can put in there. Maybe this as well. Maybe the brake fluid. All right. So, uh, oh, hold on, hold on. There is more. Get all these mosquito cans, too. Now we're freaking set, boys. What's the damage, my man? Thousand bucks, huh? Sounds good. Oh, look at this. I've got, I, I literally have a thousand marks of crap stuck inside of one single bag. Oh, wait, we can't put it in there because we'll lose it. We'll put it up here for right now. Oh, crap. If I save, it's going to blow up. Oh, no. I didn't even think about that. I should have bought this afterward. All right, well, you know what we'll do? We'll, um, we'll put it in here. All right, that's not how you do it. We'll put it in here nice and slow. Nice and slow, we'll put it in. There we go, right in the back. So even if it does explode, I think a majority of it will stay inside, hopefully. So, where is this extra building that's over by the inspection area? What is this? Is that it? Hold on here. I don't know, man. I told you, I don't really... I, You know, I, I gotta think about it, but I've never really wandered that far around. Oh, what in the... Cr what the hell is this? There's freaking fencing everywhere. Was this here before? Hold on. Is this like some sort of freaking prison or something like that? This is weird. I'm breaking into prison. That shouldn't be the way of it. There's definitely a road that goes in here, though. Look, there's a hole in the fence. Oh, I wonder if we're trespassing on some sort of finished property. What in the hell? Is this where the zombies start pouring out or something? I don't see anything too unusual. Let's go be fleet of foot here. Kind of move on inside. Let's go ahead and duck our head inside. All right, nothing to see there. The finished headbutt did not reveal anything particular. Up here, what do we have? Oh, what the hell? Is this like a, is this a, uh, is this a fish growing place or something like that? Is that what this is? 
Can I get in here? Oh, I probably don't want to go inside of this. Oh, Jesus. Yep, I'll bet you can drown. I would want to save before I did that crap. Um, I don't see anything unusual. Well, this is all unusual, but I was gonna say, I don't see anything I can interact with. Let's go walk back down the stairs over here. Kind of head toward this, uh, this rotund building that's in the backside. All right, how about you? Anything inside? Uh, no. I guess we'll go ahead and do a real quick sweep around the perimeter. Oh, there's a porch. Oh, there's a porch. And what is inside of the porch? Does this lead to anything? No, it's just there. It's just like decorative. There's not even a door up here. It's kind of odd. Uh, whatever. All these doors seem to be locked. Or I should say there's no, like, handle to actually get inside. So, that's interesting. Okay. So, this is new, correct? I I'm assuming this is the place that the guy was talking about, because I don't seem to remember ever seeing this one before. I just wanted to finish headbutt through the tanks. I don't see anything. I thought maybe I would see, like, some minnows or some fish or something. Is that what that's supposed to be? One of you guys probably know exactly what the hell that's supposed to be. Someone out there is like, that is a traditional Finnish blah, blah, blah. I just don't know exactly what it is. All right. Well, the pub's open, so we might as well go ahead and uh, grab a beer real quick. Man, freaking loud outside. Jesus, God. Grab a beer to get our thirst down a little bit. Might as well come into the bar and do this. You know how it is. I mean, we gotta visit our we gotta visit our friends every once in a while. Then it's going to be a little bit of a sleep, and I'll be seeing you guys in the morning after that, so that we can beat the living hell out of the vehicles. I did go ahead and save, so if anything horrible happens, I think we'll be all right. Go ahead down here. Ah, there we go. Yes, time on. You're you're my favorite bartender. I think you're the only bartender. There's one right in the noggin. Let's see if I can get him again here. I got him on the on the left side of the head. Let's see if I can grab the right. Oh, it's still on the uh, it was still on the thing right there. Oh no, same spot, man. Sorry, I'll buy you some Tylenol next time. Anyway, that's it for right now. Let's go ahead and get some rest. And, uh, and then, it's our own boy human waste transport guy. You know what? I'm gonna, if I can get you onto those train tracks, man. Oh, well, it's a brand new day and look at what the hell, oh my God. Look at what the hell happened in here. Oh, it's everything I thought it would be. Good God. Now, does the tow rope stay on? It sure doesn't. What in the hell are you doing, man? Oh, what a pain in the ass that guy is. All right, let's go ahead and stop right over here real quick. I, uh, how much gas do we have in this thing? Eh, we have about a quarter of a tank. I think we'll be all right. All right, let me go ahead and hook all this up over here. And there is always a random sausage to be had. All right, I think this is going to work. I don't know. I've never tried this before. Now, we should have a tow hook on here. There it is. Hold on here. Wait, shit. What, did that just remove the front towing hook? I don't think it did. Actually, it kind of looks like it did. Oh, what the hell, man? Hold on. Are you even allowed to do all this? Maybe I can't do two of them. All right, that goes to that towing hook. Hold on here. How about over here? Can we Can we do... Is there even one back here? There may not even be one back here. All right, it does not work. It's, it's connected, but it doesn't want to pull everything. It's very odd. Or I should say it's not connected. It was only connected to the one vehicle. It, like, went through the other... It was weird. So it looks like I can only tow one thing at a time, unless we use the tractor. Because technically if we tow the tractor, I guess it'll work? I don't know, if you guys can figure out how to get this tow hook onto there, feel free to let me know because I can't get that thing to go on there. But that's fine. We can still move all this over, we can still get inside of the car and see what the hell happens when we're inside and we get on the train tracks. Driving on the back roads here, doing pretty good. This guy's in our way, blam. I think that he is, uh, he's screwed and or dead. Let's go over here by the, uh, the train tracks now. Get nice and set up. I don't think that anything is coming quite yet. At least, God, I hope not. That would be absolutely horrible if it was. Now, what I think we'll do is kind of lean this right across, like, this here. Right about like that, perhaps. Yeah, that should be good. Go over here. Or not like that, put the old parking brake on, although I really don't know why. It's not like it's really going to do anything. Now, let's take a look at where our car is. Okay, good. I didn't want the car to be on the track. I just wanted this to be on the track. So things should go fairly well. 
Now all we need is a train, and less freaking mosquitoes or flies. We probably smell like crap right now because we haven't bathed in forever. Go ahead and spray myself down, maybe it'll help out. Nope, didn't do a damn thing. On a side note though, we are pretty thirsty, and what better way to insult a train other than to drink some beer while giving it the middle finger? Yeah, heist of eat too, scumbag. Let's take a look over here. I don't see any trains yet. We can go take a look. Oh, I just thought about something, boys. Hold on here. Hold on here. Don't come yet, train. Whatever you do, don't freaking come yet. I just thought about something. The whole hold on. Yes. Sorry, there's a corpse over here, boys. But you guys know how it is. Can we? Can we push this? Can we? Can we push this? Come on, come on, come on, go onto the tracks. Go onto the tracks, that's all you have to do for Gray. Go onto the tracks for Gray, come on buddy. Come on, do it for YouTube, do it for YouTube. Oh, that's a piece of a car over there. Do it for YouTube, you son. Oh shit, oh no, oh no, oh I messed up, no! No! Hallelujah! Oh no, oh god, oh no! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh no, did it just go off the freaking map? Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, alright. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to deal. Wait, well, hold on here. Is this, uh, this little opening over here? Look at the trail of food on the ground. You can actually see where the vehicle went by the trail of food. All right, um, I'll handle that later. Real quick, let's go ahead and push this guy on the tracks though. I do want to get this done. This is the best way to do it too when they're already dead. So what is this over here? Is this like a door or something? Cause I have a feeling that this is making me take a lot longer to do this. Get out of here door, I don't have time for you. It's like right when I say to myself, God, I need to move that freaking, that freaking tanker, this bull crap happens. We should be pretty close right now. This is weird that I'm pushing this car while my face is buried in this guy's junk. But whatever. I mean, whatever gets us there. We're almost there. You can see. Pushing just a little bit at a time. Just gotta, you just gotta get past all the blood and gore. Oh, the things I do for you guys. We're almost there. It probably would have been a lot easier if I would have just taken the tanker and pushed this thing onto the tracks with it. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it with my bare hands. If, if I had the hammer of Percale, that might even do better. But I don't think that the hammer has the same ultimate power that it used to have. Look at him, he's waving at us, guys. Limply waving at us. He's like, hey, Gray. You broke all of my bones, you dick. And now you're gonna push me onto the train tracks. What kind of sick jerk are you? Hold on, train. Don't do it yet, train. Don't do it yet. Oh, damn it. All right, well, we're almost there. Next time we'll get it. Next time we'll get it. Oh yeah, we're almost there, boys. This is it. This is where it's all gonna go wrong for this guy. Now we just have to sit and wait. And then, just for you, I'm gonna have to reload the game so that I can get our tanker back and our car back so I can put it on the tracks. We can actually get a lot of movement to his body. Look at this. Gray. You dirty whore, what have you done to me? <laughs> oh yeah, I love playing with this guy. I'm so thirsty, I gotta find something to drink. Luckily there was some milk around here. Oh, thank God. Thank God I bought all that stuff. Because uh, I was about to die of thirst. Oh, there's more milk over here too. Oh, glorious, glorious. Oh, that's not milk. Oh wait, there is milk. Right over here. Right over here. I don't want to go too too far away though. I don't want to go too far away. Hold on here. Oh, it's empty. Crap. Is there some more around here? That's just sugar. Bunch of sugar laying around. There is some more sausages, but I I I don't have any hunger. I'm just really really thirsty. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yes. Yes. Oh, we made it. Oh yeah. Oh, I hope you're ready for this, buddy. I hope you're ready for this. Oh God, oh God, hey, oh, the body is loose, the body is loose, yes, oh God, yes, oh Lord in heaven, oh, it was majestic, 
Oh, where did he go? Where did he end up at? I think he's I think he too went straight off the map. Now on the plus side, if you manage to do this like toward the middle of the map, you can probably get him on the ground and grab him. In fact, if we could get around all this plant life, we could probably grab him too. Now, if you remember, his vehicle is the uh it's the uh the the hitchhiker vehicle. So I wonder if we could still get inside of it, because I'm pretty sure that the uh, passenger side door opens and everything, and you can go ahead and get inside right here. Hold on now. I'm just kind of... Yep, there we go! <laughs> there we go, hold on. <laughs> ah, yes! Yes! Can we drive it? Oh, that would have been cool if we could drive it, but we cannot. All right. I have to go reset everything so that we can go ahead and do the uh, the other part of this, which is to try and sit in the back of our car while it gets blown up by the train. Here's this guy again, man! It's like this guy just wants to die, like every time. We've already thrown him on the track, so I'm not really worried about it, but damn it, if he's gonna come head to head with the tanker, I'm gonna take that opportunity to flatten his ass. Alrighty, here we go. And before we do this, just make sure everything's looking appropriate, and it is. Go ahead and pull this right up around here. There we go. Turn it off. Don't need a parking brake this time. Now we're gonna wanna make sure that, okay, maybe we do need the parking brake because the freaking thing's sliding around. Jesus, hold on, hold on. There we go, God, freaking going all over the damn place. All right, now where's our car at? I wanna make sure that we can get inside like real quick when the time comes here. Oh, Jesus. Okay, good. All right, yeah, we should be fine. In fact, I can probably belt myself in now if I wanted to. Um, I, I have no idea what is going to happen here. There we go. Let's go ahead and buckle up real quick. I have no idea what's going to happen here. I can sort of open this door. Not really. I was going to say, maybe I could open the door so that we could see slightly better. Oh, hold on. Hold on here. There we go. Yes. Yes. Just put down the window. Great. No big deal. All I have to do is just twist my mouse about 7,000 times and everything will be just fine. Some people would grab popcorn for this, but over in Finland... I'm gonna grab some sausages and beers up here in the front. Let me see if I can reach that beer back there. Kind of, you gotta kind of like right around the corner, kind of grab it now and again. Oh god! Oh, here it comes, boys! Where's it coming? Which direction? It's got me from this direction. Here we go! Here we go! Oh lord! Oh lord! Ah! Oh yes! Oh, it's everything I hoped it would be. Oh, look at this! Look at this, boys! Oh my god! Oh, this is so cool! Oh, ow, ooh, oh, oh, ooh, oh, God. Oh, it worked. It worked. We're totally fine. Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right, man. We did it. That's going to be it for this episode of My Summer Car. I hope you guys enjoyed that. It was a fantastic time. If you have any more suggestions, feel free to let me know in the comment section below. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.